Welcome to the Lumension Device Control video vignette series in which we discuss how to use specific features and capabilities of Lumension Device Control, now an integrated module on the Lumension Endpoint Management and Security Suite, to control the use of removable devices and media like USB flash drives and DVD burners within your network. Hello, my name is Chris Merritt and in this episode I'm joined by Chris Chevalier from Product Management to discuss how you can protect valuable data using Lumension device control. USB flash drives help make us much more productive but can result in data loss or outright theft. We see many examples of this in the press every day. Many organizations have policies governing the encryption of data being copied onto removable devices such as USB sticks for legal or internal reasons but have no way of enforcing them. So, Chris, how does one provide users with a simple way to encrypt USB sticks? Well, Chris, using Lumension device control is pretty straightforward. So what we'll do is here in the uh, suite, we're going to switch over to the device control policies. And here you'll see we've already pre-populated a, a default policy for every device class. So. Uh, flash drives and uh, removable hard drives and things like that show up as uh, removable storage devices and so we'll manage them that way. Uh, there's a, a default policy in place which uh, allows these devices, uh, allows these users to have read-write access to these devices and uh, you can see here though I can come in and edit this and I can block all access to anything removable storage if I want to but in this case we want we want them to be able to use the device I just want the user to have the option to encrypt the device so all I have to do is check this encrypt checkbox and I can click finish and my users will have the option to encrypt their devices now alternatively if I wanted to force if I wanted to go one step further and force them to encrypt those devices what I would do is set up two different policies and the first one would be not allowing read-write access, uh, allowing them to encrypt, and I would make that apply just to unencrypted devices. So anybody who plugs in an unencrypted device would be forced to encrypt it. That's the only thing they can do with it. And then I would set up a second permission for encrypted devices, which would allow them read and write access to those encrypted devices. And then optionally, if I wanted to, I could give them permission to decrypt that device when they're done with it, but I don't have to give that permission. So I'll set this up as, uh, will be nice as we're rolling this out, we'll be a little bit gentle, we'll give them the option to encrypt. I've got read-write permission and encrypt permission for uh, any, uh, any type here. And then, so, finish this, this gets sent out to the endpoint. Out on the endpoint, now, uh, my end user can simply just, when he connects a device, so, uh, select encrypt medium and then uh, he uh, sets it up here uh, with the password and uh, then uh, there are a few options that the end user has uh, like erasing unused space on the device uh, if we want to do that and uh, this is also something that I can uh, force from uh, an administrative uh, point of view and then uh, it explains to the user here after uh, encrypting this device will be accessible you know on any computer running Windows using that passphrase and uh, so he hits encrypt and says OK and that device will be encrypted now any data that gets transferred onto this device uh, will be safe and only accessible via that password so if it gets lost at the airport security uh, check or, or at, the, at the local coffee shop or something like that, uh, the data is secure. So you have a way to both uh, allow users to uh, encrypt their sticks and to force them to do so. Right, so depending on your, you know, your company policy or uh, you know, how you want to enforce that, uh, you can you can give them the option to en encrypt or you can enforce encryption and it, it, this applies not just to flash drives but external hard drives as well uh, and even uh, CD and DVD media. Wow, so in cases where state laws or federal laws uh, provide safe harbor for encrypted data this would be very useful, right? 
That's right. So even back in the console, there's there will be logging evidence that the user encrypted the medium. So when if a device is lost and you find it in logs, you can you can tell uh, that it was uh, that that device was encrypted. You can prove when it was encrypted. Great. Thanks, Chris. I hope you enjoyed this short video on how Lumension Device Control will help you gain visibility and control over the use of removable devices and media in your environment. For more information, please visit the Device Control page on our website, where you can get free premium security tools to assess your network today. Thank you.